so while we were spending time in Michigan, we took a lot of that time and opportunity to get in regular workouts and change up our diet for a while. It's more difficult for me to stick to a strict diet while we travel, especially if we're spending time in theme parks. So since this was a long stay in one place, we got into a pretty good routine and I even got to bake some keto cupcakes and cookies. So anyways, here's our regular, here's how our regular days went. We always start the day with making our own nitro cold brew. We found a couple of videos on YouTube and I'll link them below of how to do your own nitro cold brew and it does save quite a bit of money. We start with doing our own cold brew in a carafe with a reusable filter and then we add nitro to it using a whipped cream canister. Never tastes exactly like the Starbucks version, but it's pretty close and less than half the cost. After making the coffee, we get our shoes on and go for a morning walk before work starts. We try to go at least three miles almost every day, and that was a refreshing start. While I had access to a full kitchen, I took the opportunity to do some baking. Even though we were watching our diets, I still have a tremendous sweet tooth. Finding keto recipes for cupcakes and cookies helps me quell the cravings and satisfy the sweet tooth without totally ruining my personal fitness goals. Disclaimer here, keto isn't for everyone, but it works pretty well for me for weight loss and avoiding brain fog and low energy. Since we had access to a power rack, we took advantage and did some weightlifting as much as we could. Not many RV parks that we've stayed at have gyms, and we tried bringing our dumbbells with us, but found that ultimately they took up too much space and it was adding too much weight for us to carry around in the RV all the time. We have since gotten a band system that we now use for resistance training, and I'll leave a link for that in the description, but meanwhile, please enjoy this workout montage of what we did before the band system arrived.
that's mostly what we did in the Midwest. We had a lot of good time spent with friends and family and it was nice to kind of do a small reset monthly for trying to figure out videos. Anyway, we hope you enjoyed this different video than we normally do and we'll see you in the next one when we'll show our adventures spent in Bar Harbor area of Maine.